All right, so now we are back in action. My little ghost in my computer is happy. So we're talking about how FM is a nightmare. Okay, enough of that. Um, there's a lot of repetition, so a way was developed to show the outer electrons only. So let's go back to doing samarium. So again, we have to get 62 electrons here. So it's going to be 1s2 for the first part, 2s2 for the second part, 2p6 to go from boron to neon, 3s2 to go from sodium to magnesium, and we're around here, um, 3p6 from aluminum to argon, and then 4s2 to get to potassium and calcium. Number 21 is the 3d. Remember how the d's drop down a level. 3d10, and then gallium to krypton is 4p6. And then rubidium and strontium would be 5s2. Now our next d block, again, this time again, it's one level higher than the 5, so 4d10. And then 5p6 to go from indium to xenon. And then 55 and 56 would be 6s2. And I'm out of room, but I'm not out of luck yet. And then for samarium, number 57. Now notice number 57 is 5d1. Number 58 is on the bottom, and that is 4f. And samarium is F1, F2, F3, F4, F5, 4F5. So that's a lot of junk right there. So samarium is a nightmare. There's a lot of repetition, so a way was developed to show the outer electrons only. Valence is typically the outer, outer, S and P, and the other blocks are called core. So core notation is synonymous with noble gas notation. So let me show you how to do this. So if I were to do calcium to start with, Maybe you can follow this. 1s2, 2s2. It's a repetition from before. 2p6, 3s2, 3p6. And that took care of all of my atoms up to argon. And then I'm at 4s2. Okay, so this took me to argon. Okay. Now the noble gas notation, or core notation, looks at the preceding noble gas. So the noble gas is the far right-hand column. So I would put argon in brackets. And then after argon, which is number 18, all I have left are potassium and calcium which is 4s2. Now, if I did dubnium, now if I'm lucky, dubnium is not on this because I have an old periodic table. Oh, I don't see dubnium. Eh, doesn't that figure. Hmm, so I'll pick another one that's really far. I'll pick platinum since I have an old periodic table. I'm picking number 78, platinum. Okay. So I'm going to look at the preceding noble gas. So my preceding noble gas for platinum is xenon. All right. And following xenon, 55 and 56 are cesium. Oops, not cesium, barium. They would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There's 6. Oh, don't be stuck on the eraser. You're jammed, too. Come on, ghosty. It's not funny anymore. Okay, well, we'll get part 3. Toodles.